not got a lot of girth, but it's got a lot of length. Graphite your life. Ow! Got my heart no. All right, let's go, boys. Oh, Steve's still working on his Insta360. Today's going to be kind of a cool video, I think. Steve and I are going to Carson Coffee in Lexington, and uh, I'm trying out a lot of new stuff. So this is the this is the DJI Osmo Action 4. Swapped it out for my GoPro. We're testing that out today and I kind of set up the I set up the mic a little bit differently cuz I I went on a ride before this a couple days ago and tested out the mic and had to make some adjustments. So I'm hoping this is really good and nice and clean and you can still hear the bike. Yeah, so I'm testing out the Osmo Action 4. Um, I also got some Day and Easy boots. Uh, the Torque 3s. Air, I think is what they're called. So I'm gonna be trying to get used to those a little bit today. And then Steve, <laughs> Steve got his uh, his bike tuned by Bren Tuning. So, cause he said he was gonna do some in second gear up here. Cause before, I don't know how many of you guys know about the S1Ks, but the S1Ks really don't have a lot of power in second gear until you get up into the rev range. Now, since he got it Bren Tuned, he should be able to bring it up super easy. These boots feel really good though. And I really like this camera too because it's a lot smaller than the, the GoPros. And I'm not gonna lie, like on the GoPro, I, I just got my settings literally perfect. And uh, then I switched it to this. I can't even feel this camera on my helmet, but I never really found a good angle on my shark that with the GoPro that looked good and was functional and captured everything I wanted it to. And, and the one big thing with the GoPro is that I wanted the Hyperview look like the, the field of view, but I didn't want all of the fish eyed. And the DJI kind of does, it does a little bit wider field of view without, you know, sacrificing that fish eye look or without having that fish eye look. Oh, the one thing I wanted to talk about with the DJI before I, I need to cut you guys off so that way I can film the, a little bit on the highway in the event, but, well, I guess two things. The batteries on these DJIs last so long, it's ridiculous. So before I could get like, I don't know, it felt like I was changing batteries all the time on the GoPro. And on this one, I went and filmed a whole video and came back and it still had like 60 or 70%. So that's insane. I bought the uh, adventure package, so, or I have the adventure package, I should say. Um, so I have the adventure package, which comes with the little battery um, case thing. And it has enough room for three batteries. So I put three batteries in there and close it and it charges the batteries all the time. So I never have to worry about it and I can just plug one cable into that housing and it charges all the batteries. That's super nice because before I had four batteries in my pocket, just I never knew if they were gonna fly out or what. And now I can I can definitively, not definitively, I can definitely feel the case of batteries in my pocket. Oh, I love this DJI. I just completely turned around and I can't even feel it. That's what she said. But we're gonna be a little bit late to uh, Carson Coffee, but. See how this camera handles uh, audio up here, which I can adjust the gain a little bit in the mic so I can make it better or worse. <laughs> oh, it, <laughs> holy cow. That's sick, bro. That second gear really is, that second gear tuning, man, is freaking crazy. <laughs> Let's go! It was like... <laughs> that was sweet. <laughs> that bike looks so good. Dude, I love this bike, man. I'm hoping that the audio comes out good. Because I am doing 90, or well, 90 kilometers an hour with a... Uh, with a, uh, what am I trying to say? Oh, with that full SC exhaust. The shark helmet does a really good job at keeping noise. <laughs> he loves it. The, the shark does a really good job at, you know, keeping the audio contained inside the helmet, not letting a lot of wind noise in. So, I guess we'll see. <laughs> the fucking Yamaha shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Yamaha or BMW? Uh, which one are you picking? 
just another lonely night. Are you willing to sacrifice your life? Ah! This is the first cars and coffee that I've gotten to go to just because of, you know, life stuff, but in a long, long time. It feels like that anyway. It's probably, I've probably only missed two or three months, but the last time I came up here, Steve and I were in like three or four layers of clothes, but I got a rain energy drink waiting on me in Steve's backpack when we get here. I am living the good life, man. Oh, with it. Let's see what's here. Should be right here in this parking lot back here. I'm gonna roll through and see what is actually here. Wow, this is crazy. There's bikes over there. That's where we'll go park. Wow, I, I'm just like taking it all in. This is crazy. There's a lot of cars here actually. <laughs> Alright, we'll park over there with the boys. What's up, man? <laughs> There's quite a few bikes here. I didn't think there'd be this many bikes. Yeah, I figured if I saw you, I wouldn't. You wouldn't be at the track. What's up, man? <laughs> How's it going? Good. I didn't bring your stuff because I didn't know you were coming. No, I said you let me know. And you, I pulled in here. I was like, this mother. It's all good. It's sitting in my toolbox, so. It ain't going nowhere. Uh, this is, I just am trying this one today. It's a DJI Action 4. I haven't used one either. I just put my settings in it and I'll try it. What's up, man? How's it going? Good. I feel like this just feels so big. That's what she said, because it's all open. Yeah. Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, I want to go look at these. The matte green is kind of cool. It's so long. Not got a lot of girth, but it's got a lot of length. <laughs> what do you mean by that, brother? I know I would love to have one of these. This is my favorite truck out right now. Well, I'll probably switch my battery out, and then we can... Unless you want to put your drone up and get some footage. <laughs> Takes a lot of effort. Pretty good little meat. Um, I didn't get to go. A 22? Yeah. His is a 23, so that's the newer one. And then, I appreciate it. I think so too, but I'm a little biased. Yeah. They're really good bikes. Whenever, when I, I have another bike that I ride, and I ride it, and it's like, it's not as loud. And then I get on this bike, and I'm like, my neighbors must hate me, man. But it sounds so good. No, I've had it up to, it'll hit 100 in first gear. So, at about 170, I, my, I start to pucker, so, okay. Yeah, if you get a bike, feel free, let us know. We, uh, we normally just take it easy and chill, especially when we have other people with us, so we won't leave you, like most people do. My little brother had a dirt bike before he got a street bike, and I mean, that kid is crazy. He can stand up a wheelie like this and just hold it forever. What's up, man? Hey! I thought that was you. How's it going? Good to see you, man. Did you bring your car? Yeah, we try to make it to everyone that we can, but the past couple we haven't been able to come, so. Sounds good, man. Good to see you.